Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday I posted letting you know that Microsoft had broken the reset and recovery operations on Windows 10 and Windows 11 23H2 and Windows 11 22H2, where after installing the August 2025 Windows security updates, attempts to reset or recover the device might fail. Now just to let you know that I have good news and Microsoft as I thought it would do, has released an out-of-band emergency update for the versions of Windows affected. And if we head into our updates and security update history, for Windows 10, the update is KB5066188. And for Windows 11, 23H2 and 22H2, that will be KB5066189. Now Microsoft has this to say. This update, 5066188 or 189, addresses an issue introduced by the August 2025 security update. So for Windows 10, that would be KB5063709. And for 23H2, that would be kb 5063875 in which attempts Microsoft says to reset and recover the device were failing. This issue happens when users perform one or more of the following processes. So the first process that was causing the issue was heading to recovery and resetting your PC and for Windows 11 that would be heading to system recovery, fix problems using Windows Update, or if you're on an enterprise environment, that would be using Remote Wipe CSP. And as mentioned, if you were attempting to reset and recover, your device was failing using those recovery options. Now, I think that Microsoft rolling out the update so quickly, I think, is a move in the right direction. Although Microsoft did break the reset and recover, at least they were quick, as mentioned, to roll out this out-of-band emergency update, 5066188. And by the way, the update is an automatic compulsory update. So I literally booted up my device this morning and I saw a notification in my system tray that the update had been installed and I needed to restart my device. So it's very quick. It's not a very big update and is a mandatory update. So if you were experiencing this issue, I would suggest just checking for updates, but I'm sure it would be on your device already because it is an emergency update, an out-of-band update. And after the update has been installed, if we head to WinVer, the About Windows menu and dialog, for Windows 10, the OS build, after the update has been installed, will be bumped up to 19045.6218. And if you are running... 22H2 and 23H2 of Windows 11, your OS build will be bumped up to 2261.5771 or 2261.5771. And as mentioned yesterday, this issue was not affecting Windows 11 24H2. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.